Hey, and welcome back to Software Inc. Episode 3. Um, we're going to try some different music today. It's supposedly royalty free. If I get with a copyright strike, I'll be pretty mad. So let's go ahead and continue. We can see we have our little building right here on the main menu screen now. It's pretty cool. All right, where do we leave off? Wagging, apparently. <clears throat> All right. We just finished publishing our Chiptune Master. We have a bit of marketing going on with just one guy. Hmm, and I'm thinking... We need to, we just hired two new employees and I needed to, I wanted to train some employees. So let's go ahead and start something small then. We have four employees. It's a little too soon for a, um, you know, for a sequel. So let's go ahead and uh, go ahead and make something new. Operating system. We can try a 2D editor now that we have, um, you know, an artist. Pixel manipulation. Go ahead and do that. Uh, okay, you know what? Stick with our team size. We don't want to wait a million years to make something again. Dang. Product name. Um, let's see. What, what do we want to add? All right. Unit sold. We want to pick the most popular software. So for support again. And that's going to be this one. Maybe we should make our own. Oh, this is a free. This is a free license. Oh, it's because we already got it. Probably. Can we add another one without increasing our team size needed? Oh, uh, no, it's up to four now. Okay, let's leave it around three. Let's leave recommended team size, team size three. Let's look for... Uh, we shouldn't mess around with that because it's automatic. All right, product name. All supporting operating systems must have GUI. Oh. How many GUIs for the operating systems? Okay, product name, 2D editor. We'll call it um, Pixel Master. Sure, we'll have a master series. It'll be like Microsoft Office series. Yeah, seem good. Let's go ahead and develop it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Wait for our guys to show up. Let them get to work. You guys working on this? Yeah. Oh, it's just going painfully slow. I wish we could have time run while we um, we're in build mode. I'm thinking about making. I'm gonna try to make the episodes a little bit shorter. Um, so I might be doing more cuts and stuff since you already get the, you get the idea of how stuff works now. Should we continue marketing this? Are we making money still? I might look to see if there's any mods, right? So a mod that will let us keep time, like give us an option to keep time running while we build would be super ideal. Let's skip on use time. I really wonder if marketing is still, I mean, we're still making money off the marketing, it seems. We should probably end the marketing for this and start a new marketing campaign for Pixel Master once we get a little bit into it, maybe about halfway on the first stage. I wish the game had its own, its own music. That'd be real nice. Even if it was just kind of like the general stock music, at least I wouldn't have to go out of my way and like find music then that's uh, royalty free without worrying about copyrights and stuff. All right, so we're gonna let these guys work on this for a bit, and we'll be right back. All right, so I'm back, and I've had an idea. I totally forgot this is what we wanted to do last round. It's a secret I was keeping at the end of the uh, end of the episode. So let's skip unused time. Oh, what's this? Ah, oh, wage negotiations. Okay, I'm just gonna accept all and close. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, we're going to accept your wage demands because in a moment, we're going to make it worth it. So Courtney was somebody who demanded a higher wage, right? Where's she at? All right, we're going to train some of our employees. It's an employee home, no. Educate employee. Okay. Uh... Let's, yeah, let's take it. It looks a bit different. This is the education window. You can use education to make your employee better at their jobs or enable responsibilities for your leaders. You can e choose either educate your employee in a skill, specialization, or you can enable an HR project management by checking one of the options from below. Start by choosing the amount of months to educate your employee for. Yeah, that matters. There'd be a limit to the skills and specializations. Okay. 
Then pick what role you want to educate your employees in. If you pick designer, programmer, artist, you should pick what specialization you want them to improve in. Okay. Also, I want to look at this. I haven't checked out. I think that's research. Okay, let's see. Uh, what was she good at again? I freaking forgot. Let's check. Manage employees. Courtney is good at design. She was our designer. So maybe we should educate her a little bit more in system or 2D. Probably system because she's she is absolutely lowest in that. So mm -mm 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 -mm. educate. So design, system, and three months. We'll send you off for two. She is going to be gone for this amount of time, or at least not able to help us with any projects. But I'm thinking maybe we should just do that for everyone. So just put everything on hiatus for a moment, because um, you know everybody's going to be gone. Let's find Matt Hawk real fast, actually. Yeah, that's him. And we got to educate him some management stuff. Project management and HR management. Let's see. HR management allows the leader to take over HR responsibilities like hiring, firing, setting disputes, and raises in education. So, yeah. If we do these, we can create groups that can then produce their own softwares by themselves. I don't think we want to do that, though. Matt Hawk, what do you need some improvements in? You need some more design and system as well. So, we're going to give you some system design as well. Educate this bro in design system and we'll send you off for two months we're just gonna make sure everybody comes back around the same time uh this is dane parker i think this is our marketer right yeah this is our marketer we could um increase his ability at like other things and then he could help us with development can i just right click on here and go to educate yeah we can all right we'll just keep him uh make him good just keep him keep up the marketing skill you know what i mean Make him better at what he does. And then finally, <laughs> do we have two Danes? I didn't even notice. All right, Dane is good at art. I want him to be a better well, system designer, I guess. All right, can we just do general skill? That'd be nice. Employees just like to already scheduled for their courses. Really? Oh, because it's still selecting an employee. Is it? Any rule at work working? Do I not have you on education? I'm confused. Who did I skip? Who was our who was our marketer? I'm confused. Okay, let's see. Marketing has one person in it who is Um I don't know. I guess I can just check on our employees, right? Marketing. Noez Ruiz, you were you were the marketer. Okay, Dane Parker, I don't want you to be going to marketing. How do I end your... Oh my god. Well, I guess you're going to be educated to uh, marketing, even though you're not a marketer. Oh well. Alright, everybody's going to be gone for about two months. It's okay. Well, except you? Who are you? Dane Parker, I thought you fucking... You liar. You should be getting educated right now. Whatever. Whatever. Or are they just... I could have sworn they just left to get educated. Okay. Whatever. You know, whatever. <clears throat> I think I sit my V8. I guess we'll just give them a little bit more time. Yeah, there we go. Nobody's here now. They're uh, out getting edumacated. So as soon as the janitor comes and leaves, we can just uh, skip unused time several times in a row, and they'll all be back before we know it. Get out of here, janitor. Should just be a little bit longer from now. Can we just tell him not to come here? Go home. We'll just keep doing that. Go home. Nobody's here to make a mess, bro. Just go home. Go home. <laughs> this guy's like, dude, I only get, I get paid by the hour. Stop sending me home. Don't move furniture. I don't want to change the color either. 
it's at home. Should be the last day, I think. Maybe it's just a couple more days because we started. Yeah, I, I am aware that there are four days in a month, not two. I noticed that. There we go, they're all back. It needs to be locked. Okay. So we need to hire some IT people as well, it seems. Hire IT. Eh, let's have them come in. No, oh, eight. Perfect. And we're going to have to hire maintenance. We're going to need that eventually. So everybody should be a little bit better at what they do. And we can do that by clicking on... On... Uh, on manage employees. Oh, she doesn't seem that much better, I'm gonna be honest. Tired and cannot work. Who? I mean, you just got here. You've been on basically vacation, so I don't want to hear no complaints. Whatever. They're working on it, and we're still making money from Chiptune Master because we're still marketing it. Shush dog. It's okay. Shush, doggy. This is going much faster than last time, though. Some interesting music, by the way. We might need a janitor dude to come in during the day, because this place gets dirty real fast now. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. All right. Hint, you can educate multiple employees at a time by having them all selected before you open the education menu. Oh, that's actually pretty nice. So now we can just be like, pause, manage employees. So I think I'm just gonna go through and do a lot of education and a lot of just kind of like general making my employees better at what they do. And I'll cut until I've done that a whole bunch. All right, I think we are done training people. We got uh, three people off in training right now, but once they're back, we will be good. And everybody will have some pretty well-rounded stats. Let's take a look at everybody. Um, everybody Matt Hawk, of course, is the best. Uh, everybody else is just kind of up there. I mean, Noel Ruiz, I think he, he's going right now for 2D. And then Don Parker is going for system. Audio is not super important. And then uh, this is going to change over time because, as you can tell, we hit 1983. And we've recently just unlocked 3D stuff. So I'm going to hurry up and pump this Pixel Master out the door. So we can get something much more, um, you know, relevant to today's times out out there. Maybe we'll try to make another game because we'll have lots of money and we'll have some programmers and everybody will be much more well-rounded. Well everybody has a bit of artistic skill too now. So we're at great right now. We should be getting close to outstanding. I feel like we're going to reach that tomorrow. As you can see, it's just taking two people and they're like they're blasting through this just about as fast as everybody else was before. All right, great. I feel it, I feel it coming. It's great, great. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Oh yeah, outstanding, we made it, okay. If always tired and can't work, I don't know, you're gone. Dwayne Parker's bringing an art for Pixel Master, but it's not Competent in art and might delay the release and ruin the art. Okay, stop that then. Alright, so I don't want everybody to be working on art. Like, I want these guys to come back already. So what we'll do is we'll just, you know, put this on hold until the other guys come back. And then just put everybody on marketing. Hype the shit out of this game. Why are we paused? Okay. Everybody needs to come back. Come back from training. I want my artist artist to actually work on the art. Because, I mean, I've trained them in the arts and stuff, but they're still, like, you know, overall skill, base skill, see? So, Dwayne Lawson's the best at actual art. Uh, Dwayne Park, Dane Parker is just shit at art, even though he's trained in it. And then everybody else is pretty bad as well, except Matt Hawk. Matt Hawk's pretty decent, pretty competent. We want our buddies to get back from training, which they might get back tomorrow. Let's see. Maybe, 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 maybe? Nope. Next day, maybe. Alright, I guess we'll uh, wait for them to get back. Hooray, they're back! So, we can go ahead and assign core back to this. And assign marketing back to this. That's my hint. You can left-click and drag work items to reorder them in the list. I don't really care. 
the order doesn't matter to me. Alright, let's start working on this alpha. Hopefully it's not totally irrelevant by the time it comes out, because, you know, 3D's been out for now, for a while. Oh, we're blazing through this, though, because of our artists and stuff. Awesome. And all of our training. All of our training has been for this. I'm thinking once we publish this, uh, I'm going to pause time for a bit and work on the office. So I can actually add like paint and paint wallpapers to the walls and stuff and make it not look like a gray box. Be pretty good. And maybe uh, expand a few more rooms. Fix up some of this so it's not so uh, insane. I mean, the functions is just weird. Did he just cut through the bathroom to get to the... To get to the yeah he just he cuts through the bathroom to get to the break room i guess it's faster it's just weird all right good job janitor keep it up all right we're at mediocre level right now we'll get there we're not running too low on money we spent a lot of it but we've spent most of it on training like these guys are super super trained now So we're going to want to have some automatic stuff set up soon, like hire a team and then we can do product management, not product management, uh, um, project management and staff management training on one of our leaders that we're going to hire. And he can just automatically train people on what they need to know. It's pretty quality good. Still hyping it, apparently. Come on. Um, I really wish I didn't have to have the janitors here come here at night. And by the way, I'm sorry about the occasional mic crackles. It's just because I'm using a wireless headset. And sometimes I get out of range by like, well, not out of range. I just get something in the way. Probably can move my head. So we are aiming for outstanding quality on this one. Hopefully we're not like too late in terms of like time period for a 2D editor to be good. Especially if um, our only supported... Yeah, pay raises is this okay. Two hundred sixty bucks per month. That's fine. I had a person ask to be paid less one time. I don't think that's supposed to happen. <laughs> outstanding, great. We want outstanding though. We're close, so close to moving on to the last stage. I think we might make it by tomorrow. I wish the janitor would just go home whenever he's done. I can tell him to, but by the time it takes to click him, I might as well. You can left click and drag work items, I already know. I don't. All right, we're close. Great. There we go, outstanding. Sweet. Okay. We have to do it fast, because I do believe you can over-design your uh, software to make it less good. And by that, I mean, like, you can let them... Oops. Actually, tab down. Skip on use time. We're so close, guys. Might be able to knock this out today. Yes. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh. Release. No, I know how to do the... Never, I know how to do support. All right, then we're going to want to start another marketing campaign. Pixel Master. Market. Never. Market everywhere. We don't want core. Actually, yeah, we can let core do it. Core and marketing. Go crazy. Actually, shit, we need somebody on here. Can they split their efforts enough to get that done? Oh, let's see. Make us money. We need our product to be reviewed. Product has been reviewed. Okay. We highly recommend Pixel Master. Pixel Master is taking graphics to new heights. Of course it is. Even though it's 1983 and, you know, 3D, 3D stuff is a thing. Everybody wants that. Why? 
Uh, we're marketing it still. Okay, sweet. Market the crap out of this. We're already making, like, so much money from it. Go, 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 go. See how much we get after tomorrow. Let's check out our... I thought there was like a, a graph you could check out. Research is actually really uneventful. There's like nothing for me to research. That's kind of sad. Maybe it's a different mode, I guess. Maybe we should get some... Maybe there being more deals too. Maybe this distribution channels. Uh, not now. I remember how to do distribution channels. So this will like allow us to get more sales because we're distributing it. But we can also create our own distribution channel. Cost a lot of money, I believe. Three eight seven. Hmm. Have we made a profit yet? Not quite. We're getting there though. Oh, have we? Profit negative one hundred fifty-eight thousand still. I'm thinking next up we'll make a game, um, a three D game. Or maybe we'll maybe we'll finally work on that operating system and get that out the door. Assuming let's see if we uh get quite a bit of money for this because it's not looking too great. We got 387,000. We had 100 and something, 200 and something thousand whenever we uh, published this. Oh, 440. I think we're technically making profit now. No, not quite. Not quite. Hype it more! Hype it more! Yeah, there's no research. There's nothing to do with... Oh, yeah, there's still nothing to do with stocks. Wait, what? Did I just buy my own stock? I did not mean to do that. Are there just like empty stocks? Are these other companies? I'm so confused. Like as soon as I buy it, they become something. Shit. I read I read what this was. Do I have like three of my own stocks? This doesn't make any sense. Sell, sell, sell my own stocks. No, I don't want other people that own my stock though. But nobody owns my stock until I sell it. That doesn't make any sense. That's so annoying. So I just wasted a whole bunch of money on my own stocks. Okay. It's so annoying. I'm the only company that shows up here. Worth 267,060 share, 100%. Yeah. Okay. That's annoying. I bet if I sell that. Somebody else owns like 30% of my company now. That's annoying. <laughs> what a waste of money. I just wasted a whole bunch of money. God damn it. Oh. I don't know if I just don't understand that or if it's broken. Because that doesn't make any sense. I have all these stocks, they don't belong to anyone until I buy them. How do my own stocks not belong to me? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, let's just see if we make more money. We should make plenty after this. Oh. So annoying. Because, yeah, right now the only option would be to, like, buy my own stock when it's low, when I first start, and then sell it later on, which would be totally stupid. Oh, goodness. Just like maybe just buying my own stock gives me more money in my own company. That doesn't make any sense. All right, we're running low on money. We're not making as much as I thought we would off of this. Actually, you know, I, I knew we wouldn't because we knew stuff came out. See, we got office software, CMS, content management system is mostly used for very specific task management content, games, game engines, audio tools, office software. So let's make a game engine. Um, We have options, PC speaker, Scripting, quality assurance. Team of four. Team of six. Eh, a little bit steep. What's something we can pump out real fast that'd give us some money? Office software? This isn't real fast. This would be like a huge ass project. Okay. We could always use somebody else's uh, engine to make a game. Make somebody. Oh, actually, let's see if um audio software, audio, audio tools have updated any. Yeah, we got recording now. I think yeah, it's gonna require a lot more people. Okay, so let's go with the game. 
Music. AI local multiplayer. No. Local multiplayer. 2D graphics. Music 2D graphics. Dang. All right. We need more people. Uh, we're going to have to do it. We're going to have to just do it. You know what I mean? Just make it bigger. Hire more people. That's what we're going to have to do. It. Let's build some more office. Offices. Some longer offices, sure. Oh, well, now I'm regretting that because it's like a weird. Mm, why is this have to be weird? Okay, you know what we'll do? No, I don't want to do that. Start from here. Like a sideways office, sure. We'll do that. Two more offices, so we'll have uh, three, four, five people on the main team. I can't make a room here. All right, we want six more people. We want six people total on the main team. And if I remember right, we can just right click on here. Nope. Right click on the floor and say, select select the entire building, select furniture, and we can control Z, can, oh, not control C. We can say copy, if somewhere here it is. Reset the default, move furniture, furniture color, duplicate and then we can place it over here uh, in this case we'll want it to rotate right yeah we won't do that but we want to start up further up duplicate 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 oh yeah to select all the furniture first then we can right click and we can hit duplicate then we want it here now we can rotate it boom do the thing again, and duplicate, boom, and duplicate, boom, okay, door time, no, not development time, door time, door time, I have to go back to here, doors, hopefully no problems come out of, uh, you know, let's we'll just put the door here. All right, one day. Well, I really hate these fans. Does AC units, like, it says something about doing it like an entire area. Temperature. Yeah, it says industrial air strength conditioning unit to cool down entire building complexes. So if I just freaking put this here, can I get rid of this? And this? Yes, I can get rid of several of these. Okay, I'm getting rid of these fans. They'll be quieter for each room. If I have any problems, I can just add more AC units, right? And you know what? We'll put another one here just for... Why can't I put another one? There we go. That's what I thought. There we go. So we got two of them for the whole building. A little tiny little AC unit. They do the whole building. And you know what? It's probably best to get like a central heating unit as well. Wow. We need just like a huge ass room for this, don't we? Okay. We'll build this in the basement one day. Because we do have up and down, right? I think it's like page up, page down. Or is it here? Yeah, we build in the basement and we can build upper floors. Like up to skyscraper levels. For now though, we're just going to be working on our first floor. We got cooling. We can deal with just having radiators in each room. Um, I don't like the fact that it's so dark in here. But we're just going to have to deal with it. I mean, it's not actually dark. They got lamps, but... It's not lit up on the screen. So we got all rounders. So let's get programmers. I'm going to specialize on all of it. And we're not going to, not going to be lightly. Begin looking. Skill. Good compatibility. Flirt and extrovert. That seems fine. Sign up the core. Do we need another programmer or are we need a designer? Let's get a designer. I know it costs like five thousand more dollars to look. So let's get two more designers actually. Four thousand eight hundred. You're good, your compatibility good, flirt snob, doesn't matter, compatibility's good. 
Uh, let's hire you. Wait, why can't I? Oh yeah, I forgot. It's... Is it like over here? Oh yeah, why is it scrolled over? Alright, whatever. Compatibility normal. Compatibility good. We're really gonna go with that. I'd rather them work good together. So we got all employees we want. Two more program two more designers and another programmer. We might be reaching capacity for our little bathroom and our break room. So we'll go ahead and buy them a better coffee machine. Needs. To get a better coffee machine. Heck yeah. Espresso. Why is exp Sure, I'll pay 150 bucks for it. What the hell? Why not? Uh, can I get you guys a TV? Office? Uh, reception? Outdoor. I find it interesting. I can't place these outdoors. You have to place furniture inside your rooms. <laughs> okay. Seems legit. Alright. Let's just go with that. And we now have six employees in core. Which means we can probably start working on an operating system, right? No, no, we need way more for an operating system now. If we wanted to make a full-fledged operating system, we need 15 employees, and it would take about two years with the amount of people we have right now. So no, we're not going to be going with an operating system. Uh, we can try Game Engine though now. Six. Yeah, let's do it. Feature will unlock in 1994. Okay, scripting, 2D rendering. Oh my, never mind. Oh Jesus. Okay, we're gonna have to make a specific game engine. Okay, we want scripting, we want quality assurance, we want 8-bit audio, we want 3D rendering. That's gonna require a lot of people though. Okay, I think it's one more than what we'd get normally, but let's just go with it, right? Can we even make a 3D game right now? Are there any other engines? in existence that have it. Yeah, version 3D tech. 3D tech. Hmm. Let's go ahead and see what it would take to make a 3D game. So we got up to two we want. We'll start over here, actually. 3D graphics. Why can't I grab that? No, we don't want text space. We want Feature depends on 3D rendering from the game engine, which is not available in the market. Wait, what do you mean? Oh. Oh, I need a 2D editor. Did I make my own? Why don't I just use my own? Can I not use my own? Okay. Sure, we'll just use the most popular one. I'm just test testing right now. So. Let me get this state. Vision 3D Tech doesn't actually offer 3D. Which is not available on the market. Fine. We'll make our own 3D engine. I don't care. We're going to make a game engine. And it's going to be... Scripting, quality assurance, 8-bit, 3D. Oh! Scripting, 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 scripting. 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 Hmm. Except for the game logic from logic logic. Fuck it. We're doing it. Wow, is there only one operating system out right now? For this new age? Oh, I want to make an operating system so bad. How many people are using it? Active user zero. Okay, never mind. Ugh, we're thinking too much. I'm going to think about this for a while. Okay, I settled on making a CMS. I think we can make a pretty good one for what we got. Actually, that's not what we want to do. We, eh, active users, this doesn't matter. So, this is we're gonna do this. We're gonna make a CMS. You haven't picked. Oh yeah, name, name our software. It's gonna be CMS 5000. So yeah, CNS is um. I think we need to do two different types, right? Workflow or the other one? I think workflow is harder to make. Yeah. Workflow is hard to make. Let's do financial. So we just do everything but quality assurance. We'll just add statistics in. That's great. More than a year, less than a year. Right, let's do this. No document generation and the statistics. Fine. Develop. Let's go, people. We need our new employees to come on in here. All right. 
Wait for our new employees to show up and then we'll do a cut and see how far we can get. I think it's going to be pretty good. This is a new age software for kind of... Did I not select a support operating system? Didn't didn't make me. That's interesting. Alright, we got our new employees in here. Why are you working so slowly? Too much noise in this room. Oh, shit. Okay. Move. We'll put it in the bathroom. No, no, not that. That was fine. We want to move this to, like, a room that's not going to have a lot of, like, nobody's going to care if there's noise. You know what I mean? Like, this one. And, I mean, Matt Hawk is usually the one that sits in this room, but we're going to go ahead and move it over here. So the break room is going to be the coolest room in the entire building. There we go. Everybody's happy. Except you. Why are you too lazy? I just got a raise. Yeah, you did just get a raise. Why don't you do some work? Alright. Let's just educate them. Actually, let's educate these three. Control, control. Three. Where's the third guy? Did I not hire? One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Wow, I, I'm missing someone, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Did somebody leave? Maybe somebody left. Okay, let's hire somebody else. Okay. I thought we hired two designers and... Um... Okay, let's just hire someone else then. I'm so confused. Another designer? Sure. We want them to be the best we can get. Compatibility, very bad, so no. We're gonna go ahead and hire you. Chelo Lopez, naive and generous. What a great combination. All right, and then we're gonna go ahead and get our three fresh employees. Uh, eh, we'll have to wait tomorrow for the other person to show up. We don't have a ton of money left, but I think we're gonna be able to pull this one off. Why are you not working? Go home. Oh, it's the marketer, that's why. <laughs> Dane Parker calling in sick. God. Who does she think she is? It's like she's been with the company for years or something. Six, seven, eight. So if you have eight offices, we should have eight employees, right? One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, perfect. Losing track of my own employees. Jesus. Okay, when they're all in, I'm going to send them off all throw for like some sort of training to at least make them not totally crap. You know what I mean? <laughs> Come back here. Go sit down at your desk. I need all three of you to be there. All right. All three of you are new, right? Yeah, Brandon Fuller. Let's see. Who are my people? I fucking forgot. Nicole, Marcel, and Brandon. Nicole, Marcel, and Brandon. So. Brandon. Nicole. Wait, what the fuck am I doing? I can just select them here. Nicole, Marcel, Brandon. Alright. You guys are bad at, like, everything. So, we're gonna make you, like, not bad at everything. All of you are designers. I'd not even. That was an accident. So yeah, you're getting. You're getting. Which one of you is the worst? You're the worst. I'm sorry. You're getting fired. And I'm gonna be hiring a, a freaking. <laughs> I'm hiring a programmer now. Salary. Why do I care about salary? I thought this was just the budget. Whatever. We want overall skill, please, as a programmer. You have good compatibility, and you are pretty good at programming, so hire. Now we can train you guys to actually be, like, not bad, right? Yep. Oh, wow, he's actually pretty good already. Okay, so we're going to train all of you guys in, like, actually, you two, two guys. We're going to get some training in, like, 3D 
design. And then you are going to get some training in like 3D programming. And then we're going to skip that 3D programming. Okay. And then I'll be back. All right. Welcome back. It's been a while. Uh, you can see I decorated the place. It doesn't look the greatest because of the doors. I can't paint the doors. It's really annoying. So we just have these white doors and green walls. But as you can see, we're running out of money. But we're also getting pretty close to uh, getting to the next step. I might just go to the next step right away. We have trained our new employees. And I also trained Matt Hawk in uh, HR management. What are you doing? So that means if we really want to, Matt Hawk can uh, manage um, hiring and firing and dealing with pay raises and also educating people. But we want to get a hold on this money situation first. We're close. Great. And as you can tell, we're back to the piano music. I think I prefer that to the to the techno or the whatever the heck that stuff was before. Great. Come on, come on, come on. Everybody's working on this except marketing dude who's marketing. I think we might need a bigger marketing team. And I think we're due for an office redesign um, for efficiency this time. Hey, dog. You don't need to go out. You've already been out. So stop it. Stop your whining. Outstanding. Sweet. Move on to development phase. Don Parker is working on art for CMS 5000, but is not competent in art and might delay the release and ruin the art. Well, I'm not... Fine, we will specifically tell the art person to be an artist. Is that what we have to do here? I tried optimizing roles before by um, giving them specific roles, but then they, they would just stop working on things whenever whenever it went to the next phase. So like designers would stop doing anything when we went to programming to actual like developing stage, obviously. I feel like it'd be useful if I had a much larger company. I could have um, groups of people just called designers or just called programmers that I could assign them to different stages of a, um, of a, of a thingy. But for now, we're just going to focus on doing it this way. That would mean a multiple projects at once. But for now, I think... Oh, he's tired and he can't work. Why? Oh, it's the end of the day. 194,000. How much does this put us in the hole? Yeah, we can't check. Hmm. You want 181 more dollars? How about I just lower that a little bit? Because I, I can't just uh, accept that without without a problem. Alright. This is going to take a bit again. Oh, it's so slow. Actually, we can, we can unequip marketing from here. Stop that. Work on the marketing alone. Alright, I guess we'll be back when this is about done. We are so close. I had to take out like I didn't take a lot. I had to take a bunch of uh, contract work in order to keep our heads above the water. But I think we are super close to hitting that outstanding quality. Our marketing is out of control, and then we'll be swimming in money again. Hopefully, hopefully, so close. Great, we're on great. And I found out there's a little mini game thing here, and it like multiplies how fast you're working. I guess, I think. Anyway, we're gonna have to try that out again. I wasted all my lives this time before I really understood. All right, outstanding, promote. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's gonna be done tomorrow. And then everybody will be marketing the crap out of it. I wonder if we can just like pause for a moment before we release and just mark it. Eh, what the hell's the point? We'll just release it and then we'll market the crap out of it like normal. Come on, we're under 200K again. I spent a lot of money, not, not money, a lot of time getting above 200K. So many bugs. Wow, this is a big project, isn't it? Might not get it done today. Dang. Whew. Either way, it'll be soon. Real soon. I was playing around with these little priority things. You drained all your wives. Wasted all your wives already. Fine. Wasted. Screw you. It's like, you have to type in words as they fall down the screen. It like, says multiplier times whatever. I think it, like that's how fast you're going, maybe? I don't know. I'd, let's tr I'd love to try it out again on like another project. You have like three lives though. If I was better at typing, it'd be amazing. Oh, come on. There's so many bugs. People better freaking love this thing. Because it's ridiculous how many bugs it has and how long it's taken. It's only taken about a year though, I'll be honest. So it's still not bad. We need to hire more employees. Like a lot more employees. And to completely restructure the way that we handle... Um, employees and like projects and groups if we want to if we want to make like 
um, more progress or like f be faster at doing things. So I'm definitely going to be restructuring things so they're uh, more space efficient so we can have more employees. Whew, we're definitely going to have some groups that just kind of govern themselves. Wow, I think this is the biggest project we've ever made. Oh, come on, tomorrow. Tomorrow is happening. You know what? I don't care if you call them sick. You're just going to miss a... You're going to miss the real big release, mate. You're a loss. Release! And now we want to go to market again. Thomas is working on art. No, he's not. We're in freaking support at this point. Okay. CMS 5000, we're going to start up another marketing campaign for it. All the places. And we're going to want marketing on it. And core. Start campaign. Let's go! Market this crap. Market this crap. Work on those support tickets, too. Okay, this is kind of higher priority. But I want you to work on both. And we're keeping up with pace. The demand. Okay, this is way more high priority. Can I make this like priority? An employee is tired and cannot work. That's fine. Just get over it. Tomorrow, I think we'll have our first reviews in. I hope. And they should be good. Yeah, here we go. CMS 5000 is taking content management to new heights. Of course it is. Everybody loves it. Holy balls, we made a lot of money off of our first sale. There. First sale. First day. Um, yeah. Yeah. Oh, jeez. The support tickets, though. We're keeping up with it. Almost. Oh. Alright, let's see how much we make tomorrow. Yes! This was a success. This is so good. Oh, this was a huge success. Amazing. We were already, like, way, 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 way making profit. CMS 5000, our profit's already 268,000. I think it was that marketing, though. That marketing, though. Whew. I think we might finally be getting into the, the real part of this game. Where we're, we have tons of money to expend, and we can just start setting ourselves up to create massive projects. How much are we going to make tomorrow? As soon as we get these support tickets out of the way, by the way, we can market this hardcore. And we're making even more money. Wow, we broke a million! We broke a million, guys. Also, I figured out how stocks work. We have to go to all software. We have to look at other people's companies. And then we can... Oh, not all software. It, it's all companies. And then we can look at their stocks from here. And then we can purchase stocks and earn, like, revenue. Uh, the biggest company is worth over a uh, billion dollars. It's kind of insane. Their stocks are absurdly expensive. Just saying. Holy cow. We finished the support bugs and now we're just gonna market the crap out of this thing one million sixty nine thousand dollars one million three hundred and nine thousand dollars all right we're millionaires guys we're millionaires our mad hawk is because he owns this place you guys are just getting paid your normal your normal salary this is awesome okay so next episode um we're gonna want to create larger rooms right instead of just single offices we're gonna want to make large rooms with uh that can fit many many desks that way we can have entire teams stationed in um singular rooms and have them organized and just kind of completely run autonomously by their team leaders um we might want to create a whole section of our business that just kind of creates their own software but that has a chance to um, dampen our reputation if they produce some bad content that's why I think what we're going to do is just kind of make like a training group. Maybe. Um, just a bunch of people that we throw into a room with each other. And then we have um, a team lead just kind of um, trained in HR management. That'll uh, make sure that they keep on. They they're get sent to education. They get education. And they end up being really good employees. Speaking of education. Um, it's 1985 and networking exists now so i think we're gonna have to educate everybody in some network code see nobody's proficient enough in it and i'd rather keep the same employees oh we are up to one million eight hundred and fifteen thousand dollars that is some good profit if you ask me let's check this monthly profits some good stuff good stuff i want to release some software that makes this much money that'd be amazing 
took like a team of six people uh, an entire year and a half. Why are these people sitting down? Okay. Let's see how much we make tomorrow. We might break two million. If we break two million. Oh, we broke two million. Awesome. Okay, so um, we're going to have some major overhauls on the office and the team management tomorrow. Um, next episode. Tomorrow, next episode. It might be the same thing. But for now, it's going to be next episode. We can really start taking off as soon as we can uh, have things start happening automatically. And start having things, um, like having bigger teams. So I'm excited. And you should be too. For now, though, uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you next time.